Right, so here's the home page as we left it, and there's the script that goes with it, and the style library that goes with it. Now we're going to play a little bit with the style library to get our gallery, which I won't show you yet, but I'll, I'll get to it. All right, but first things first is look about will pretty much look like home. So the home one, which will turn into about which I've done already so just have a look it, there's not much going on it's just a little bit of a change here just show that you know when you click one or the other they actually change so I'll show you what about looks like exactly the same pretty much same style library I think I, ch yeah, I just changed the order of the pictures so that means when you do this you get that they look exactly the same pretty much it tells you about go back over here and have a look at about about website and the pictures are rearranged all right now when things get a little bit interesting when you want to start playing with a different type of flex layout and so to get as I said earlier with gallery what we want to do is we want gallery we're going to make gallery so it's all pictures and none of this is in the middle okay by that I mean it's going to look like this all right I'll just go out a little bit further so there you go so and I mean you can play with pictures and stuff but that's pretty much what we're looking at and when it resizes the pictures just do that so they stay the same size you can notice the menu gets a bit smaller because that's from previous but as it is it just stays like that so the gallery pictures just fit themselves best as they can given on three different setups that we've got um, if you want to play with them in with the stuff and ca add more you can but we're not going to worry about that at this stage all right so that's that now what happened well here's gallery first let's just walk ourselves quickly through a little slightly quickly through this in the home we had header article a side one a side two footer what we now have in the gallery is header a side one, a side two, a side three, and a side four footer. So article's gone. There's no middle. It's just one, two, three, four, and I've just picked out pictures at random here and put them up there. So that's why it looks like that. Okay, and moves when you resize it. You can actually do a bit more to push those two straight down there, but we're not getting to that part yet. That may happen later. So at the moment, when you resize, pictures stay the same, and they just wander down one under the other. Now, what actually makes them do that is over here, and what I've done is I've taken the style library, and I've renamed it gallery, so that I don't lose the original one. Now, there's other ways we can do this, but at the moment, it's just another style library that looks pretty much or a lot of it's the same but some of it's different this is where it's different here if you go back to style and have a look that's what it looks like at the moment this is gone we took that out because we don't need it we've still got this we still have to have this what that's telling us is when it's we want everything to fill the entire screen when we've got a small size and it would do that except that these things change all right that's what changes it and makes the layout change down there okay so we've got all that that doesn't change that doesn't change that doesn't change that doesn't change but this does all right when we get to the min 600x in that bit we haven't done anything yet you can if you want and if you're going to do that then you're going to split it up in this one if you go back and have a look at the style down the bottom this min width which is like from 800 and bigger so the maximum stuff it used to look like this it used to look like that it now looks like that okay it now looks like that and so one two three four the order that we want this one will sit at the top regardless okay and you could if you wanted to though just play a little bit with that but we've left that the way it is for now and everything else is exactly the same and when you do that you wind up with the gallery HTML looking the way it does so that's it now we'll just stick with that for the moment so two CSS files one for gallery and the other for home and about same style library for those two okay so you get the same look about it we could 
um, actually create two CSS files, a media CSS that we pull up depending on which one it is but we'll just leave everything as it is and have a fair bit of rep repetition going on at the moment so that's what we've got and that's why we wind up with this and as we bring it in they go like that now you might want to get a whole bunch of pictures that are in a certain order for a certain reason and watch what happens when they where what order they go and where they finish up each one of these is an aside one two three four and then they replace themselves in different spots we may if we have time look at putting those two straight underneath when we move to the middle one so that when we get to there they both drop down it's being a bit pedantic I suppose but anyway so you get it there and then you get it there so still pretty good there we go